got here, we actually passed through these two, this arch made of two large whale bones, and I just found that pretty, pretty awesome. And it was just so amazing to be welcomed, even though we're from another part of the world. Uh, it is absolutely gorgeous. You can see the mountains in the distance and icebergs speckled on the far side. I find it beautiful and I'd like to move to Greenland someday. I like the warmth and it reminds me of home because it looks similar to the towns in Nunavut. Unbelievable. Just ice for miles around. I, oh, I can't even describe it. <laughs> I just feel, I feel so lucky to be here. This is like nothing I've ever seen before. Like we went up the boardwalk and then just seeing all this like magnificent beauty is crazy. I'm ready for the green screen to come down. Yeah, I'm ready to just wake up from the street. It's the same. This, well, this is a fjord, an ice fjord. This is not the Yakutabak Glacier. The terminus <laughs> is far up valley from here. So what we're seeing here are icebergs that have calved off the terminus of that <coughs> glacier. Obviously, looking at this, you wonder what's gonna happen and you wanna know how to fix it, how to make things better all the time. Let's say I want my kids to like, feel what I'm feeling and see the same thing, but if we don't make a change, like that's not gonna happen. It's a great indicator that the ice is, is melting, the glaciers are shrinking at a tremendously high rate. You can imagine all that ice going into the ocean, it's melting and it's raising sea level around the world. So even though it's this very local climate change, it has global impacts. If you like look on, look forward and not just look now and just have like a little blinders on the side of our eyes. We have to look forward for like our kids and their kids. Like humans yeah. are so for themselves, you know, but it makes you realize like, no, you're all together. At the end, you all have to like come together and fix it because without this, then we're not here, you know? Yeah. By being here and experiencing this place, I want them to remember that, uh, that this is a dynamic environment that we're, that we're living in. And, and if we change the system, if we change the natural system, it's going to have dire consequences. I hope they look at this scenery, which is incredibly powerful, and realize that they're powerful too. On the reins of your chariot. Everything here is just a mix of emotions. This whole trip is just, we're sad and we're happy and we're excited, but we're nervous. There's so many new things to be scared of, but there are so many things that we just need to experience. Take this weight, lift the I think that with all the people I've met here, I think the future is going to be in good hands. We all really care about this. We're passionate people. Matra.